Okay, welcome again to Math Games. This is, this is Bruce Lewis here, and what I'm going to do today is show you the game called NIM. It is a game that is played with, usually it's, it's been played like with matchsticks or sticks. In this case, instead of matchsticks, I have these Q-tips. But what the kids do is they put them into as many piles as they want and it doesn't matter how many are in each pile they don't have to be equal piles so come on over to the table here and I'll show you what we're gonna do it takes a lot of thinking to try to decide who's gonna win so okay let's see I'll make these three piles here yeah, just randomly we're making three piles and what's gonna happen is um, the first player is going to take as many as they want from any one pile. You can't grab from two piles at a time. And the object of the game is to be the person who takes the last either Q-tip or as many. You can grab a whole pile if you want. So if, if all that's left is this pile, well, I'm going to take the whole pile because then I win. But I can't grab from both piles like that. I can only grab as many as I want, even up to the whole pile. So let's say I take um, this many from this pile. So my colleague here is going to come and he's going to play. Let's see how many he takes from his pile. Here we go. Grab what you want. He's going to grab that many from the middle pile. Okay. So I'll take all of them from this pile except one. And you got to really kind of think it through. And you want to make sure you get the last stick. That's the goal. So I'll just take that many. Let's see what he does. He might have a good strategy. Uh-oh, I think he just won. All right, so I'm stuck. I have to either take from this pile or that pile. If I take from this pile, he has won. So good job, young man. Way to go. Okay, so again, we could have started with eight piles if we wanted. Let's play one more quick game. We'll just throw them out there. We'll move real quick. And then I'm going to show you some math that can go with this to try to decide a winning strategy you can... Teach your kids the winning, how to get a winning strategy, too. Okay, here we go. I'll take all but one from that pile. What's he going to do? He's going to take all those from there. Okay, I'll take this whole pile here. Hmm, who's going to get the last one? Okay. Let's see what happens. We've got four piles still here. Who's going to win? What's he going to do? Yeah, we want to get the last stick. Ooh, he might have done it to me again. Let's see. I'll go there. I think he did it again. He got those. So he did it. He won again. Okay. Well, let's... Okay, well, I hope, we had, hope you had fun learning about him today. So, um... You might check on TeacherTube. There's a file on there that teaches you more about NIM and also a winning strategy. So it has to do with the binary numbers. So it's really cool. So check that out. Check out other games that we're going to have for you on TeacherTube from, you know, for these math games. So I, I enjoy showing you these games. I hope you're enjoying watching them. So thank you very much.